I got Christmas nails. Red and a couple of sparkles on there as well. I'm very happy with them. My lovely Christmas nails. It is the Party Girls on Purpose Advent Calendar Countdown, email countdown. <laughs> and it is day 12 today. And this one is all about, well, Frozen is out in the cinema. And one of the most favourite song, famous songs from Frozen is let it go. I'm not going to sing that because it's definitely something that you guys don't deserve to hear. But this is all about letting go. This exercise, what I want you to do is try and use this exercise between now and the new year and also make it become a habit as you go into the new year. And it's what, what I want you to do is to catch yourself whenever you're feeling um, like a negative thought or something like some, you know, I have been terrible in the past with like road rage, so someone cuts me up with a saint stupid, my first reaction rather than be like, oh silly person, is, oh God, what are you doing? And like, just going, ah, like, ah, and wanting to shout and like, obviously they can't hear me, they, you know, they're, they're, they've probably driven off by that point. But then I remember in the past, I used to stay with me, like, thinking, oh, idiot, rah, rah, rah. he could have caused an accident, and it would go on and round and round and round in my head. So now what I want to do, if anything like that happens and you catch yourself, you just I want you to start becoming more aware of when it's happening. The more aware we are of what's going up, on up here is the more we have the power to control it. So try now, anytime you're in that, you'll feel that energy. Like see my shoulders come up as I'm trying to explain it. It's like a constricted energy. Whenever you're feeling in and not uh, relaxed and out, you're in that constricted energy. Catch yourself, take a deep breath and just say, let it go, let it go, like just, and that's it, and then just, it, when you, I laugh sometimes, you think, okay, that's gone now, whereas in the past, it would have been with me, probably for the rest of the car journey, and I probably would have got out of the car, and told somebody about it as well, now it's gone, and then sometimes now I even add, um, you know, I hope you, I hope you get to your destination safe, and, you know, wishing you a safe journey to the person that actually did the dangerous thing, especially if they're speeding or something like that, because, that, you know, you don't know what, you don't know the reasons behind it, and, you know, they, or they could be heading to an accident, so, I always try and send love <laughs> once I've done it. So anything like that. Another thing is someone does something to annoy you. Instead of getting, when you start to feel that, like, you know, on a dog, you see their heckles go up. And it's like when your heckles go up and you start to feel that constricted energy, deep breath, and just let those shoulders drop and let it go. She had some very wise words, words that did Elsa from Frozen. So I want you to start thinking that now. Anytime you get a negative thought, anytime you're caught in a, a negative thought way with like somebody, somebody else or something that's happened, let it go. Just take a deep breath and let it go. I know Joe Vitale, he's from The Secret as well. He has a little saying like, so say anything happens, you say, I'm sorry, thank you, I love you, please forgive me. But you can say it in any order. So you can say, please forgive me, I love you, thank you, I'm sorry. Or you could say, I love you, forgive, uh, forgive me, I'm sorry, thank you. You can mix it up, but that's another, it's just a quick little thing in your head that just stops that thought, that negative thought whirling around, lets it go and makes you just feel better. So this is a nice quick tip today, is just to let it go. Get rid of, heckles up, let it go. Someone annoys you, let it go. Someone cuts you up, let it go. Because it's just, uh, especially you know, especially with someone in, like in a car with in the car situation is what I was saying, or even with some other things, you've walked away, you've left that situation half the time, but it stays with you, burning up really good energy for the rest of the day. When if you just let it go, you can focus and move on to something better. That is it today. I've been Lauren Victoria Ellingham with my new beautiful Christmas nails. I hope you like them. Uh, and I hope you're enjoying this. Please email in, let me know what you're thinking. Please uh, join the Party Girls on Purpose private Facebook group that's starting to fill up now. There's some fun things in there going into Christmas. And also, you can also subscribe to the email list or share this with somebody that's not subscribed to the email list. They can start getting these wonderful videos too. Keep forgetting you're already subscribed because you're getting it to your inbox. Anyway, have a fabulous day and I will see you tomorrow. Beautiful, fabulous, sparkling, wonderful party girls. Till the next time.